your Raiders, welcome back to the channel, it's Jared Gaming, having a great today. Uh, this is a Raid at Shadow Legends video. Uh, this is going to be a bit of a showcase for Taras. As you saw uh, on my last video, I managed to get him out of the uh, times 10. Um, and we've got a double void actually this weekend, which is great. I'll be doing a few shards on Sunday. I'm not going to go too mad, just because I don't want to tempt fate and, you know, just take the mick. But I've been very lucky with the shards with regards to that. So I'm just going to do a little showcase with him today um just in the standard arena and we'll uh got half an hour left we'll just do a couple of fights in the live arena as well just to see how he gets on there um show the sort of comps i've been using with him the setups um but i'll quickly show you his build how i've got him at the moment um so i've gone to put him in a single set of well, four piece stone set with two pieces of Immortal. Uh, I've got him uh, up to 87,000. Quite sort of tanky, nice bit of defense. I don't want him too quick, but I want him quick enough to get a couple of goes in. So, um, I mean, some people have got a super slow. You can kind of run him, I think, two ways, like a super slow um, with Marichka, where she sort of takes hits and he counters, or she make her fast. So she does her A1 and then he does his A1 as well. It's a couple of different ways. Again, we'll get into that in the fights. Um, just you know, max out his crit, as much crit damage as I can. Um, I ideally wanted a bit more resistance on him, but to be fair, it's it's not too bad. He's you know, Rich is there to cleanse. Um, the stone skin's fine for any sort of fast buffs and bits and bobs, so it's it's generally working out all right. Uh, Rich out as well. I do. I'm running her slow. Um, making it nice and tanky, um, not lots of resistance, and uh, she's again she's just had to sort of cleanse and take those AOE hits. So then uh, Taras then does his um, counter attacks. So I'll show you that in the um, oh, I'll show the masters as well. I'll show you that as we kick off the fights. But as I was saying, there's some other people that I've been talking to on the chat so, um I couldn't quite comprehend just how good these two are together. I mean, yeah, you see the videos and you hear everyone saying, oh, they're amazing, they're amazing. But until you've actually you'll use them, it's just it's just nuts. It's absolutely nuts. Um, I'll quickly go for his kit. I know you guys probably know already. Uh, double hitter, 40% uh, chance of placing a decreased attack. Um, and we've got his A2, which is actually really good. Hits really hard. Attacks when he places a stun for two turns, deals double damage to those enemies to attack it equal or higher than this champ. Um, so that's generally quite a lot of the, uh, especially if it's your nukas, AoE nukas, he's going to counter attack them. And with Marichka, Marichka on the team, it's every time. So it's, it's just amazing. It's just incredible. This is his big smack, which, funny enough, is his animation is just like. Uh, you guys seen Kung Fu Hustle? It's like the sort of end move that the guy learns at the end, the big sort of poof, big power move, like a big fist. It's wicked. Um, anyway, big AoE, increases 15% for each buff on allies. So you know you want you, you see fears, your duchess, anyone that's gonna be given everyone lots of buffs, it works wonders for this guy. And then it heals um for every other buff, blah 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 blah. So that's fine. Passive. Now this does sometimes come a cropper. Um, when everyone's running the sheep because he'll place this at the beginning um, and then often he'll uh, turn into a sheep before the, the match has even started so that's a little bit annoying but um, it's not the end of the world uh, again the, the sort of, some of the comments you're running are nice and slow and tanky anyway so by the time you sort of cycle through it's, it's generally fine when attacked decreases enemies attack by 10% up to 50% occurs once per skill so that's kind of cool and then this other one as well when coming damage from skills is reduced by 50%, so he just lasts forever. I mean, this again, this comes up um, with Marichka. She does do the uh, the cleanse. Where is it? Oh, oh that's weird. Sorry. Uh, they're one of the cleanse moves, and it actually replenishes the um, this one. And it heals, uh, yeah, fully restores all decreased max HP. So, I mean, that is obviously 
to go hand in hand with Terra, so that's, that's cool. So let's just, I'm just going to do a couple of standard classic arena matches first. Um, and I'll show you a few of the comps I've been running. This is pretty much, uh, not that one, sorry, this is the, pretty much the one I've been running most of the time with um, a net grip putting his main protection on there so when he does the um, attack you know he will join in with the double punch which is great especially against rotus and that sort of stuff um another sort of debuffer debuffer and uh speed sort of debuffer uh you, you sort of anti rotus team that sort of thing so there's a few different comps but generally it's kind of like a slowish buff up take damage wait out some of the uh the turns if i haven't got a buff stripper then you just got to kind of play through until those buffs come off after a couple of turns so this one um kaimar's probably going to give us um it pro i've got it's probably, it's probably going to strip the stone skin but we'll see how it goes um edgy probably shouldn't be too much trouble we see how it goes i don't think It'd be an issue. I would run. I'll, I'll, I'll turn also off. Just we we'll just see what happens with Kaimar. Um, he's always a bit of a pain to go against. Um, okay. Right. So we've got the fears. So there you go. So we've got the fears, but he's done them already. So that's we had that true fear out. Not true fear. Sound of fear out from uh, Taris at the beginning, which is his passive. Lucky no one got the sheep, but that's fine. He did remove Taris's and Marichka's. Not ideal, but that's fine. We'll do some um, the uh, Duchess is a two <clears throat> straight away. You see that he done his AOE. He hit Marichka. He then does his um, counter attack with this a two, and he's gone. He's down already. So Hedgy did the same thing. He did his AOE, and he, he got a slap as well. But also, it was just, didn't realize it was so fast that uh, you probably might not have seen it. Um, I probably could just. Slam now. They haven't got many buffs on, so this should, yeah, nice. It's it's just crazy, guys. How good, how good this guy is. Sorry if I sound a bit croaky, guys. I um, I was out last night for a few drinks, and there was karaoke at the bar. Um, I didn't actually sing. I would I didn't get up on stage and sing. I just sang along to some of the songs. So I'm a little bit croaky from singing uh, sort of cool music we had yesterday it's supposed to be a star wars themed um you can see it's supposed to be a star wars themed event down at this pub um but and i do like a quiz and stuff like that but and yeah no one actually bothered to do the quiz i think everyone was just too uh merry um and so we just put the karaoke on and drank so there we go that was a good night it's a good night right why am i doing that one that's too easy um oh okay here we go nice tanky team so this one, lots of buffs. So let's just try, let's go over and go. The mighty. So we've got a Serga who's going to definitely soak up some of the damage. Um, let's slip it down a bit so we can see what happens. Will they go first? Let's see. Let's have a look. And she's going to spin everybody up. And right. Okay. Let's see if Uko can take some buffs off. Don't really need to go into that one, do I? Okay, so it's not that many. First hit and slap. Nice. Okay, he's back, but it's fine. Um, I could do this. That will probably take out the Baron, that's for sure, but it's not got many buffs on at the minute. I'll just do his A2. See, it still does a fat 60k to her. The server took a little bit as well. But it's totally fine. We'll bring Necrit back. And don't need to really do those at the minute. I mean, I could have some more buffs onto him. We've got strength and we've got some shield. I just realized I didn't actually show you the masteries when I said I was gonna show you the masteries. But um, basically um Rich has sort of down the as you would down the sort of healing route with the more uh, healing, more shields plus some resistance and that sort of stuff and Taris is again uh, all down the attack route down to skull crusher um, and I think he's also uh, on the defense route as well so 
Uh, no, actually, no, sorry, that's a lie. He's actually got the HP, um, and I think it receives more healing. Because he does heal himself, doesn't he? He heals himself, so I think I've got that healing mode as well for him. But, again, I, I, we can always tinker about with his, um, his masters. But so far, I mean, it's all been working pretty well. Uh, again, he's not got many buffs on. Let's just give Sifi a couple of slaps. Serga's soaking it all up right now. I want to put that on him. Give a little smack. Okay, thank you. Polymorph is ridiculous as well. That, that needs sorting out. Things what what grinds my gears with Polymorph is is that when they come back, they've got half health, and more often than not, they get a turn. So if you Polymorph someone that can do four res like Pythian, Duchess, uh, even Uko, um, chances are they come back and then they bring everyone back. It's it's just really really annoying. It, I, I do, I mean, I do use it, so I can't complain, but I do actually really hate, hate Polymorph. It's just a really, really poxy awakening to uh, blessing to, to go against. But you got to use it, you know? you got to use it. you got to fight fire with fire. If you can't beat them, join them, as they say. Right, now we'll, uh, now we do the slap. It's buffs on everybody really. It's the one not having Duchess is um can be a bit of a pain. Actually I don't know why this comp is like this. I think I probably should have got rid of um Necret and then put Duchess and Uko, but there we go. Anyway, let's uh let's just give her a smack. Oh, 80k, that's not bad. Not bad at all. Buff strip. Has she resisted? No, she did not. Oh she brought my back. That's fine. That's totally fine because now we do the Fist of Fury and we will make everyone go to sleep. Right, let's just do some extra buffs. And so, oh, of course she has Swift Parry. It's not a prop. Not a prop. Do, 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 do. And go for it. Bom, 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 bom. That should be it. Nope, she's still there. There we are. Good. That was a bit of a, that was a, bit of a tough one. Some of the worst fights I've had actually with these guys. As you see, I'm getting a, I'm getting sort of close to the the cusp of platinum. Some of these teams are just ridiculous. So let's um, see what we can do in live arena. <laughs> I found that if I seem to go second and put Taris and Mitchka in, um, the uh, here we go. Watch, watch this. One in about one in five players um, just sort of quit. <laughs> let's see if Vala. See if Vala's got more. Uh, more sterner stuff. I'll probably run a similar sort of comp to what I was doing. Okay, Hedgy. Hedgy and an Uko. So, what are we going to do? What are we going to do? So, Rinchka should be counter attacking Hedgy, so that's fine. I'm not too fussed about him. Um, Let's put in Duchess and Georgie. That's her old, that's her old actually. And I'll probably put in what support should we put in? Probably go double nuke. Oh well. There we go, he's made a choice for us, isn't he? So I am going to block. Rotus would actually be the more annoying one, to be honest. He'll probably block my Death Knight. Okay. Fair enough, mate. Fair enough. Oh, that's okay. That should be okay. Let's see if... Um, 
on the left night it's kind of slow as tank is in stone skin we should be okay as long as Uko doesn't strip all of our stone skins we should be fine I probably could have done with uh, some of the strips and buffs as well actually okay not ideal that was not ideal Oh wow, that protected everything. Oof. Oh dear. Wow, Harima's actually pretty pretty tasty. Right. I think he's gonna Well I've got zero buffs, so that's not very good. Uh Harima. Good. She'll just bring it back, but that might buy us a turn, or Uko will. She'll be block damaged. Okay, that's handy. But, I need a cleanser. It's not great. Oh, he's got a Zena stun set. It's quite a good move. I have a uh, Hedge in a stun set as well. That is actually a really good setup. Works very well. All right, he's going to sleep. That's fine. Doesn't work. Still haven't got any buffs, but I think I can two punch Arima. Nope, just short, just short with that one. All right, can I get my res revive? Come on, come on, Duchess. Don't sleep me. Thank you. Here we go, we've got some buffs. And Uko is a sheep, so fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. We can get um get his move out. Right, let's see what we do with this. Nice. Right, come on to evolve. We've got to take out take out uh Sifi. Uh, more buffs please. Right, see if he's gonna get a go. Hmm. Uh might as well. Right, I probably need to take out Uka. Seeing as Seafy's used her revive, so that's fine. She's now gonna try and slap us. That's okay. You can take a dirt nap. Game over. Let's see if he quits. Yeah. But there's a will, there is a way, guys. Hopefully we'll have time for a couple of fights. I did, I want to try and get Richka in there um, at the same time. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Right, pick first. Who should we pick first? Should try and uh, uh, let's go with a let's go with an Uko. Okay, so they're going speed, that's fine. We go Duchy and we go and leave them right to the end. Uh, I reckon they'll get a speed boost to speed speed. All right, well, let's go. Where are you? Where are you? Um, where's my? There he is. And oh. yeah. After that, they'll probably pick someone tanky. I reckon it's going to be a Trunda, Trunda team. Five star, five star awakened. It's a serious arbiter. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. Let's see what they make of that. Hoping he blocks Hedgy. 
Um, I probably would say Nish Nishak is the worst. I could probably resist um, Gaius. Right, who's he blocked? Hedgy. Oh, he has blocked Hedgy. Excellent. Excellent. Cool. This should be a good one. Doesn't matter if they go first. We're all in stone skin. They're not going to strip it. The only thing we've got to make sure is that we resist or get Gaius sorted out. So if we can get an AoE hit and hit Marichka, we can actually take Gaius out. Okay, just, there we go. There's one. Speed up. Now, just got to resist the bombs. Resist the bombs. That's okay. Bombs are gone. <laughs> They've been cleansed. Okay, they're back. <laughs> it's just... Uh... <laughs> just so silly it's just so 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 ridiculous all right four minutes come on come on honestly guys i was just shocked at just how broken not broken maybe broken i don't want to say it in a way that means you know they need to be changed but they're just so mental good um you know it's account it is they are two champs that change accounts. They are account changing the champions. Right, we're going to speed again. That's good. Uh, let's go. Dutchy Nuko again. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Cool, 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 cool. So we'll then go Marichka and. Let's go Marichka and do, 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 do. put Leo in there. Seeing as he's uh, the times 10 champ this weekend. You guys gone for the uh, times 10? I want to pull some shards as I said on Sunday. Um, I, you know, I could take, I've got another Leo as well. I could take him to a plus two. If I get another one, it'd be plus three, but um, yeah, that's that point. I, I might, I might do. I'm gonna do a few on Sunday, and then we see how it goes. Right, who do I want to get rid of? That guy's annoying. We should be able to tank a hit from him. Yeah, Coronar's annoying. At least he hasn't got um, Cephalia on the team. It is Cephalia. It's team that was, isn't it? Oh, that's annoying. Right, okay. Well, who's the faster one? It's Uko, isn't it? That's fine. This is okay. It should be fine. Alright, there we go. What are we gonna do? He's feared because of his passive, that's brilliant. Although fear is still running 50-50. No one's gonna uh what's that? that? Cardio could cleanse. What happened there? What we're we gonna do? Is he gonna cleanse the fear? Or is he going to do ally attack? It's cleansed. That's fine. Who knows? Oh, I've got to turn off this, this camera. Right. Uh, we will do the buffs. And we do some buff strips. That won't take off, the, obviously, that. Oh, I didn't put the... Uh... Oh, that was annoying. Did I put the block buffs on? No, you're not killing him. You're not killing him. Looks like a, looks like a fire spirit. <laughs> Fair enough. Fair enough. Can we sneak one more in? Yeah. And that's kind of how the games have been going, really. Once you get these two guys, um, you know, they're like, well, we can't win. Unless you're obviously, yeah. I bet when I get to silver, I'll be uh, eating my words. But um, so far, it, uh, it's not it's not been too bad. I have to check what my, what my uh, win ratio is. At the minute, again, we go it's Goko. So they 
I like starting with Uko because you, you don't really know where you're going. You could be a speed team, you could be a go second team. Right, these guys are it's gonna be annoying. Um every time I've used Romantu, um I can never actually strip the buffs. Um if I put him in, I'd rather still have a Duchess to be honest. Let's go Duchess and Galio again actually, he worked pretty well last time. I reckon he's gonna put Who's going to be his damage? I reckon this could be. A, oh, okay. Yep, yep. Fine, 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 fine. Excuse me. This is a Taras showcase, so of course we're going to have Taras and Richka. On me again. Right, who's he going for now? Could be another. Oh, Raglan, okay. I'm going to ban you because I want to keep my stone skin. He's going to ban Richka. Mm. That's annoying. Oh, it's a Taras showcase, man. Don't ban my Taras. Oh, people. Right, let's do it. To my cleanser. Oh. Come on. She's gonna bring him back. She's, he's gonna bring him straight back anyway. Oh, mate, come on. Oh. Okay, guys, I've just chopped all that out. That was almost 12 minutes of utter pain. Um, horrible, 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 horrible. Um, anyway, I'll uh, I'm gonna leave it there, guys. I think this has gone on for ages. Oh my days. Anyway, that was so uh, the Terrace and uh, Mirichka duo little showcase. Um, I'm not going to bother running in dungeons and stuff because you know you're not going to run there. If you get if you get them, you're going to run them in arena because I mean you can run them in in dungeons and stuff. They do do some good work. I say he hits he hits massively hard, but um, you know there's there's plenty of other champs out there that are much better suited for PVE, PVP. Nah, no, man, it's, it's just, they're just incredible, incredible. So I'll leave it there, guys. Thank you for watching. Appreciate it. Please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. Thanks again for your support, guys. Um, getting me over that 500 mark is amazing. And uh, the road to a thousand subs, we are getting closer and closer every day. So thanks again for your support. Really appreciate it, guys. And I'll see you on Sunday for some Void Shard Balls. Take care. Bye.